This is some wild caught sockeye salmon. Uh, I found this at the store, and the you can tell the difference between wild caught and farmed salmon because the wild caught salmon has a darker red color to it. Um, this has to do with their their diet and a whole bunch of other stuff that is. Uh, the wild caught salmon has um, healthier fat in it. This is a, a healthier piece of fish than the farm bot, although they're both pretty good. I'm going to try and prepare this. This has got skin on. Scales have been removed, as usual. I am going to try and do this in the pan. Uh, I've never done salmon in a pan before, but it's uh, supposed to be pretty good. So, I'll give it a shot. First thing, a little bit of seasoning. Uh, I'm going to be using some smoked sea salt. Smoked sea salt. Blah, blah, blah. Smoked sea salt. Um, I really like the flavor that this imparts. Uh, it adds that little bit of smoke. And dogs. Next is some garlic powder. I like a lot of garlic powder. And of course, freshly ground black pepper. I'm also going to season the skin side. I normally don't like the skin. Uh, I'm going to try it. I was looking at some videos online of people crisping the skin on the salmon. And because the scales have been removed, it is perfectly edible. I'm just not sure if it's something I'm going to like. But, we'll give it a shot. Alright, we got your basic skillet. This is, you know, the cast iron. I like cast iron. And add a little bit of fat to the bottom. This is leftover bacon fat. I'm going to put this in skin side down. I'm also going to throw in a little bit of butter. Mostly because I'm going to do a little bit of butter basting. And you can see there's this sort of color demarcation line where part way up the sides it is turning a little bit more opaque. That's a good way to watch and see how your uh, salmon is cooking. Uh, you can actually see it. I'm going to flip this over and see how it looks on the skin side. <laughs> I'm going to right quick.
Yep. Actually crisped up pretty good. Yep, no, you can't. Alright. All right, going to open it up and have a look. That's pretty done. It doesn't have a lot of pink spots in the middle, so it's kind of a medium, I guess. Mmm. Okay, that's pretty good. All right, I have to try the skin. Uh, please let this be good. Hmm. All right, I'm not a huge fan of salmon skin, but that's actually okay. The crunchiness really does change it. A little crispiness to it, a little crust. The flavor is very much just like salmon, so. Try a little bit more. Hmm. Just need some sauce, like a, a dill sauce or Maybe you know tzatziki. I think I'm gonna have some of that. I'm gonna try that. But for now, yeah, it's pretty good. Salmon is really actually pretty easy to cook. Um, it's hard to go wrong because you can undercook it, overcook it, and it's still good. I have dogs that I have to take care of. Let's try this. Oh, yes indeed, that's a good combination. Mm. Okay, this is good, definitely going to try this again. Um, in the meantime, I'm going to eat dinner, so till next time, see you guys. Mm. Mm. So good.